How's it going, everyone? And welcome back to Sleep Out Earth, where today is still part of the Tuesday Streamathon, where I'm building Whispers of Death. This one is mostly built by the in game deck builder, making some additions of my own. For example, I took out an Eagle Horn Bow, and I don't have Princess Hurhan, and I put in a Polluted Hoarder. And I'm thinking about taking out Unleash the Hounds. And we're going to add in something else here. Probably something along the line. Spawn is also not too bad. We can go better. Then again, I only have Death Rattle selected. That's all I'm going to see is Death Rattle. So I should probably uncheck that. I feel like I need some good survivability. But here's what I'm thinking. I think we put in... Bear trap. Where is the bear trap? I have a feeling. Yep, there it is. Bear trap. So that's what we'll do. So that's our own take on whispers of death. Let's get it started, shall we? So those of you who saw the Murloc decks. Oh man, those are some great games. Probably not gonna see any of the likes of that ever again. I'm really tempted to do uh Casual. Let's hop up this. We'll do we'll do one ranked. But how about we do it after the casual? Because I'm feeling like a pansy. I got that win streak going. I don't want to lose the win streak. That would be the worst. If you lose your win streak, then it's almost like you're not even playing the game. And that's just no fun. No sorry. By the way, uh, out of curiosity. I want to know what you guys thought of E3. What you liked, what you didn't like. Anything in between. Anything you didn't expect. Definitely curious to know. So with this, we're going to toss Tomb Spider and Sylvanas. We'll keep the others. Sounds like a, an excellent start to the day here kind of tempted to put in an Ancient Harbinger just to get that Nazoth out here quicker. But I don't know if that'll necessarily be necessary. Such a loud screech. At least it's the golden one. Always the golden one. That certainly wasn't very nice. But three damage off the bat. Can't complain. Okay, um, I guess not a whole lot to play here. I could do Animal Companion, but I don't want to use the coin. I'll just burn down to 25, because why not? And the crowd goes wild. We're fighting against Ghost Dog. Does that mean he was from Call of Duty Ghosts? Like, because it's Ghost Dog? Terrible jokes, is what you can expect here. Because that joke's like two or three years old by now. Oh, cool. We even got the uh, taunt, which is kind of what I wanted. Works for me. What is Misha doing? Can't really tell what's going on in that picture. Hmm. Yeah, I don't know. Oh, it's going to be on a spell power rogue. Is a, is a popular streamer making that popular again right now? Kind of what I want to know. We will kill command. Um, I could do infested wolf. So I will. Because why not? Well, the, uh, the safest bet at the moment. Because I think it comes out with two spiders. Yep, and they're going to be beasts. But the good part about that is if he doesn't kill them. I can use my kill command at least to get rid of this 3 5. God, that's annoying. Kind of wish I had my explosive trap right about now. I could make him think it's an explosive trap. That'd be fun. But I will not do that. Oh, man. Yep, he's just going to kill them all. What a meanie 
jerk. All right. Um, well, I'll tell you what we can do now. Throw this to Van Heim in. Good thing we held on to the coin. Because let's see if we can make some good progress with this. And he's going to sap it. And it's going to get him another one. Got so many princesses that are just ready and eager to learn. Oh, this is so annoying. <sighs> it's a good thing we're not doing ranked, but then again, casual can be just as bad, if not worse sometimes. Okay, so now we'll do Savannah High Main for real. Hope there's not another sap waiting in the wings for me. This guy's probably really confused. Hunter without explosive trap? It's not a real hunter at all. That person would probably be right. Oh, come on. At least next turn I could actually just do huge toad kill command. And this charade once and for all. Because alas, it is getting very annoying. But it won't really matter because probably gonna kill me next turn. In fact, I, yeah, he has lethal, whether I kill it or not. So, that was fun. Let's make him think it's an explosive. Maybe, or maybe not. Which one is it? Perfect. Now I guarantee he doesn't have lethal. All according to plan. Even better. And I win by the skin of our teeth unless he has something to boost up his weapon damage, which... No one this guy is probably the case. Yeah, this guy is so ah. well played. This guy's toast getting me once again. Good on you, ghost dog. Good on you. Well, I guess that teaches me to play casual. So I'm not sure I'm a big fan of the how of how the uh, hunter plays with death rattle. But then again, we were facing off against a very aggressive deck that I had no answers for. My lack of answers is kind of disturbing. Did I even have two explosive traps in this deck? I'd be very surprised if I didn't. Hmm. Could have been facing off against a dastardly death knight. I don't know how. There's no death knights in the game. Maybe that's a spoiler. Man, we're facing off against a storm cloak. Ulfric storm cloak would be very proud. Unless I beat him into a pulp, and he would not be proud. I guess we'll have to find out where it goes from here. Not going to be starting off with much, because I'm not going to be starting off with anything. Alright. So we're going to play with the Jewel Scarab. And we're going to get... Hmm. Probably Tank Master, to be honest. Not a bad deal either way. Not exactly a whole lot of, lot of good things in here. I mean, think about it. Tank Master can't really do a whole lot. That we don't already have. Oh, that's right. I forgot we could change uh, his stuff into. Uh, I thought it was a friend and friendly minion, not just a random minion. That could have been bad for us. <laughs> could have been. Could have been very bad. Oh, 
one against Cthulhu right here. Well, let's make things interesting, shall we? All that boosts. Yeah, buddy. Or no Ragan. So next turn. Probably play out Infested Wolf. Or I could do Huge Toad Kill Command. Get rid of his Twilight Elder. It's probably the better idea, to be honest. Unless he doesn't get rid of my Forlorn, as I can just use that. Never mind. Kind of dashed my hopes a little bit. Combo is still a combo. Could also do Unleash the Hounds. But I wouldn't, help. I wouldn't be able to use Kill Command. Go ahead and get rid of him. And there we are. Now we have a 4-3 on the board. And we're in business. We just gotta kill him before he gets Cthune. Which knowing hunters isn't the hardest thing in the world. Let's see if we can make it happen. Kinda of hoping we can. Then again, it'd be kinda of silly of me not to hope that. Don't you think? Come on, man. There's gotta be something you can do. Good to see the silence is still strong enough for people to still run it. Guess that's a good thing. Um. Hmm. Kinda wanna do Infested Wolf. Just because, in case he has something else to out of silence or put this away, I'd rather him burn it on this than uh, Savannah High Main. You know what I'm saying? Well, that's certainly not the good best thing in the world, but we will make light of a dark situation. Let's go ahead and do that. I'll also summon a companion. Oh, even better. Uh, I think, yeah, I'll we'll just go ahead and get rid of him. Do a fiery bat. And we definitely gotta go face, because we need, we need him not to get to uh, Cthune. So it's a bit of a race for the face, unless he really wanted me not to kill that guy. I bleed from the that would do it. Well, it's only whenever this one takes damage though. That's not the worst. Alright. Kinda hope it guns for the 2-1. Kinda worst case scenario really. Alright, evil humbo. Not too bad. We can play that out with uh, Tomb Spider. Now oh, that's a pretty good deal. I think we go with. Hmm. Stick with me on this one. Now we go in there. Yep. I don't really have a whole lot else to say on. I don't have a thank you button. Or a you're welcome button. Alright. Oh, hey. It's dead. Oh, hold on. Someone on Twitch who is chatting. Can't figure out how to spell that name. Or I sound with the name. It's dead Omega. I'm going to assume I got it somewhat close. It says, I finally caught your one of your streams. And watch your YouTube vids sometimes. Well, hey, it's good to have you here. I always like it when new people, regular people, whatever people, whenever they join, it's always cool. I always find it interesting whenever I see someone join for the first time and watch the YouTube stuff. It's gotta be kind of a cool thing to catch it live. There's not a lot of YouTubers that I follow that I'm able to watch stream. I know for the longest time, like, uh, I would try to catch a walk around to a stream. 
but it didn't really work out too well for me. All right, we're gonna save our evil horn bow for now. Let's see if we can pull off. See, the plan is we put out something big. It's not Cthum, and I kill it. One of these, Savannah I mean, the two beasts that get summoned out. I can take advantage of the starving buzzard. But it has to be something that I can kind of run into. So I just put a starving buzzard. It's gonna be a target. Oh, don't kill it now. You don't want to do that. You don't want to do that at all. I implore you to think otherwise. Ugh. Well, there's that. I guess that's interesting enough, but not all that great. Is it just a beast? Yeah. Well, I'm really hoping when I draw a beast. But a horror is not a beast. And I can at least get rid of this. Stop thanking me. It's annoying. I have yet to draw an Azoth. I have a feeling he's going to get his Cthulhu way before I get my Azoth. If he doesn't already have it somehow. That'd be uh, not too fun. Oh, that's not good. Does he have it? He's gotta have it, he's playing them now. Oh dear. There it is, folks. Gonna add insult to injury. Jesus. All right. Seems a little excessive. So, not giving up yet. Perfect, in every way. Let's see. Uh, See if he fall for it. See if we can get that Cthulhu. Well, even if he does get Cthulhu back, he's just going to play it again. Oh, he should attack with his Cthulhu so he can get another Cthulhu. It'd be kind of funny. <laughs> just say never lucky. Now, you should have been here earlier. I got hella lucky. I won like four or five games in a row with my Murloc deck. So, quite honestly, I'm not even. I'm really not even upset. It's more of a uh, when I build the deck, I want the I want to be able to test out the concepts of it, and I need an Azoth to make it happen. And unfortunately, I've got no Azoth. This deck works. This deck works really well. Okay. I wonder if the reasons hurting so bad is because I'm casual. These people just throw together wherever they want. I got some crazy builds going in there. But I got my win streak unranked. How much time I got left here? Got time for one more game. You know what? Let's see if we can get it. You never know. And even if I lose the win streak, doesn't mean I can't get it back. It only takes like, what, three games? Not too bad. I'll just play Murlocs over and over and over again. So what is this guy? What's this guy's name? Matt Majushin? It's uh, quite a tongue twister. Um, I'll toss the explosive trap for now. Ugh, evil horn bow. It's not what I wanted. Lynch the Hounds is not what I wanted either. Get some more Death Rattle in my hand. Gotta take advantage of the Forlorn Stalker. Let's make magic. Oh dear. Uh, 
Let's see, after this video, we're doing Overwatch. I don't know what I'm trying to prove here. I don't really have enough to make it worth it before one wants to talk about then again if I put out loot hoarder. He's just gonna ping it anyway. So it would have been kind of a pointless adventure. Drilled scarab. Now we'll wait on that. Oh we got one out of the deal. Try to hold on to the stalker for a bit longer. Yeah, tonight's Overwatch specialty is going to be, uh, we're going to start with the Tracer and move on to, hmm. I'm trying to think who else. I guess it'll be, you know, we'll let the first game decide what we need. If we're on defense in Hollywood, I'm doing Tolpy one because that's the best map for him. I know it's so specific. Alright, um, let's put out this. There's at least enough death row to make it worth it. Next turn we can put out a nice 4 3 Lou Hoarder. Or. Yeah, we can do Lou Hoarder and uh, Unleash the Hounds. And this Hunter's not that great of a deck. This is mostly a Blizzard build, so I can blame them for it. I can also blame me for not a. Uh, Really taking the time to refine it, I suppose. Okay, so now... Here we go. Get rid of you. Definitely get rid of that. And we'll put out this. And... I guess go face. Probably gonna take like a five minute break after I'm done. Just to kind of stretch my legs. Unfortunately, my back is kind of stiff because uh, I sit so close to the mic, I kind of have to arch over for it. Can't really sit back. Alright. Um, I think I'll just do a quick shot. Um, Probably just gonna kill this right away, to be honest. Not a huge deal. It's kind of annoying. I'm trying to think of a witty name for this video. But I can't think of one when I upload it. Okay. Um, let's see what we get. Um, kill command works. He's got seven damage though. I have no heals, so even if, uh, and again, he doesn't have 7 damage because of Freezing Drop. But he gets the battle cry off of that again if he plays it. Not that he needs to. But he does have it. Attaboy. I can't really name the video for this deck. Something badass. Get people's hopes up. This one did not work out at all. I guess you're right, Kazoon. My deck does betray me. Alright. Let's go ahead and quick shot this. Get rid of that. 
animal companion, get the taunt, and then oh, eagle horn bow. Go for the face. We're getting there, boys. Steadily. Surely. You're getting there. He's running out of cards. There's hope for us yet. It's always a good thing when they run out of cards. Try ping the minion. Problem is. I might be running out of tricks. Alright, um... This is a tough call. I think the answer here... Simply blue or... Go face. Go face. Go face. Go face, go face, go face. It's probably not the best idea. So if he uses that mana worm to kill my bear, he's gonna ping it, mana worm, go for my face. Or not, he's not gonna go for the face. Alright. We now have nine damn wait. We have lethal. Guys. Guys, we did it. Don't ask me how. But we pulled it off. God bless America. Keep that win streak strong. Wow, I gotta say that's, that was unexpectedly hilarious. <laughs> Here I'm like, oh man, gonna, gonna die, gonna die, gonna die. Next thing you know, boom, came back to win it. Oh, so good. Well. And that was unranked, and I kept my win streak. That's a good time. Yeah, it's like I'm on a hot streak. Maybe I should keep playing Hearthstone, but no, I really want to play some Overwatch. Hopefully, the hot streak will carry over to Overwatch. That'll be a, a good time. All right. So, just want to take the time to thank you guys, whether you're watching on YouTube or whether you're watching on Twitch. Just want to thank you for joining me, as always. And don't you dare forget Tuesdays. It's between six. Uh, sometime. Six or after six Eastern Standard Time when I stream, and then it's always going to be for two hours, unless uh, unless stated otherwise. And you can always find out more information on that. You follow me on Twitter because that's where I post the updates, and all that kind of good stuff. Sometimes I forget, but I try to get on it. But yeah, just gonna go ahead and uh, we're gonna end it here. So feel free to stick around for some Overwatch, and uh, of course, I hope all of you have a really good night.